This is problem number 23 from the 2005 AMC8. And there are two really important pieces of information that you need to recognize in this problem. And they're given to you right at the beginning. Uh, so this is an isosceles right triangle ABC. Um, and an isosceles right triangle means two things. It one means AC is equal to BC. And then number two, it means that this angle is a 45 degree angle and this angle is a 45 degree angle. The second piece is that the semicircle has area of two pi which means the circle has area of 2 pi and since the area of a circle or the, the total circle is an area of 4 pi so since the area of a circle is pi r squared if you solve this equation r squared equals 4 so the radius is 2 so this length here is 2 and you might be thinking well I don't know what to do right now because I need to know what this length is but the key is drawing in this segment right there if you draw in that segment we know that if a radius is uh, intersects with a, at a tangent point, then it intersects at a right angle. So that's a right angle. We know that this length is a radius, that, so that it's 2. Since this is a 45 degree angle, this small triangle is also an isosceles right triangle, which means that length is 2. And then if we draw in this other one, that length is at a right angle as well because the, all four of these are right angles, which means that's a little square, which means this length is two, so the length of BC is four, and the length of AC then would also have to be four, so the area of the triangle is one half times four times four, which equals eight. So it really was, turns out to be a pretty simple problem, and you never had to figure out what that length is right there, though you could if you needed to, uh, because it's just half the hypotenuse, and we now know that the hypotenuse is four root two. But in general, the problem turned out to be pretty easy once you realize that you had these 45 degree angles and that square when you drew in those two radii to the um, tangent points.